Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be showing you guys the newest, fastest way to get high ground. People actually thought it was a 90 return, but there's a new thing going around that most of pros are using right now, not normal players. So let's get right into it, guys. Alright, so this is a little similar to the 90 degree turn, but it's also pretty different. So I'm going to show a quick demonstration on how it looks. Alright guys, so I've just demonstrated what it looks like, and I'll show you guys how to do it. Alright, so to do this new building meta, you're gonna have to have some experience in 90 degree turns. You should probably get the 90 degree turn tactic down first, and I actually made a video on it on how to create your own 90 degree turn style, and so let me demonstrate how a normal 90 degree turn looks like. So you have to get that tactic down. You can do it however you want, but there is a guide to create your own style of a 90 degree turn that will be linked in the description of a video I made about it. But once you get that done, you'll be ready to take on the new building meta. The one I demonstrated in the beginning of the video. So let me show you guys how to do it. All right, so first step, you're gonna wanna get used to not building a wall to your left or right to block yourself like this. And keep in mind, this is going to take a lot of practice, so don't be frustrated if you can't do it on the first couple of times, or if you've been practicing for a little bit and you still can't get it down, you will get it eventually. So let's move on to the second step. Alright, so this step is more like a tip, and a fact, something you're gonna need to get used to. When you're doing this new building meta, you have to get used to jump fatigue, and I think we all know what that is, but if you don't, let me simply explain. Jump fatigue is something you do when you're mostly building. See how I'm jumping a lot? It will slow you down and give you tiny little jumps. So you need to get used to that when you're doing this new meta, because this is going to consist of a lot of jump fatigue. So how to counter this is you should wait a little bit before you jump. But for example, let me demonstrate. Alright, so I messed up in the end there, but that, that doesn't matter. So this new meta is going to consist of jump fatigue, and so I recommend only doing this three up, then staring out like this. So staring out like I just showed you in that demonstration will stop your jump fatigue. And if you jump every second and a half, I'm pretty sure jump fatigue won't occur at all. Alright, so this last step is pretty straightforward. And also, this is more of just like a tip. Basically, all I have to say is just practice it all the time. Whenever you have time, just hop into a playground match, get some materials, and just practice this as much as possible. This took me a lot of practice to do. It's going to take some of you guys at least a day or some hours of practice. So yeah, just practice this every day. Alright guys, that's all I have for this video. If you enjoyed and learned something new, please drop a like and subscribe if you haven't already. If you want more videos like this, or you have other video suggestions, please let me know in the comments. Alright guys, hopefully you did enjoy this video, and peace out my friends.